This week in the Mount Sinai Spotlight, a cancer survivor climbs mountains for multiple myeloma research and how marijuana could be the answer to the opioid epidemic. Hi, I'm Yasmin Hurd, professor of psychiatry and neuroscience. We have an epidemic um, in the country. We have more people dying of opioid overdose than even dying of car accidents. And actually more people today in the U.S. are diagnosed with an opioid use disorder than with cancer. Addiction is a chronic relapsing disorder. So craving is a huge part of why people relapse. We have seen that a cannabinoid in the marijuana plant, cannabidiol, helps to reduce uh, drug seeking, drug craving. By decreasing craving, we can reduce the number of people who will overdose, will, in, will reduce the number of people who keep taking the drug. Any type of medication that can reduce craving will go very far in treating the opioid epidemic. I was diagnosed with smoldering myeloma in 2012. We did Kilimanjaro last year. We raised about a quarter of a million dollars. The entire Moving Mountains for Multiple Myeloma raised about three quarters of a million as of now, and maybe even more at this point. Being that I can do this, inspire other patients, and raise money for the, to find a cure is that much more important to me. We really cherish patients like Stan who are ambassadors, who go there and show that you can beat the cancer and you can live your normal life. Having cancer has been a plus in my life. To help get the word out there, to help find a cure through the MMRF, to bring in donations, to let people know through awareness. Well, definitely, I, I don't think any of this would have happened had I not been diagnosed with cancer.